Welcome to a day in my life as a ballerina and a model and influencer. 19 years old, living in New York City. I washed my hair just now with my bread hair wash. So it's freshly clean and I just dried it with a microfiber towel. And the way that I've been doing my bun is very simple because I like to keep my morning routine as stress-free as possible so I go in with my bread hair cream and I have a full curly hair routine on my TikTok and on my Instagram reels I believe so today I have about two hour ballet class um, I usually do flat and point and then a little bit of variation but I genuinely have been having so much fun doing it um, and just kind of getting back into point getting back into ballet like classical ballet um, especially on point. It's been a while since I've seriously trained um, on point, so that's exciting. And then I go on with my bread hair oil. This oil, every time I use it, everyone thinks that I'm wearing some sort of special perfume because it smells like strawberry lip gloss. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but I genuinely have been enjoying using the hair gel so much for all of my slicked styles. This gel is amazing, it doesn't flake, and it's so good for even just like curl definition. And then I use my bread hair scrunchie, of course, and I just twist my hair around itself. And tie the scrunchie on and boom. I'm ready for ballet. <laughs> I'm all ready for class. I have my bag packed. My hair is done. I will show an outfit OOTD once <laughs> I get to dance, but I'm just wearing this little pink zip up. I always like to get to class a few minutes early to warm up, stretch, and mentally prepare for class. Right now, I'm just warming up my toes and prepping them for my point shoes. And while I do that, Miss Victoria plays bossa nova jazz and we catch up, which is honestly my favorite part about class. Um, follow my trainer on Instagram to see more clips of my day-to-day -day training. Yes. And squeeze. And. Okay. Now hold it on. Okay. 
once class is finished, I really like to take some extra time to stretch and wind down. It's really best for your muscles and your, for your overall flexibility to stretch after class because your muscles are fully warm and that's when you're gonna get the most out of your stretch routine. Let me know in the comments if you guys wanna see my entire stretch routine, which I have been doing basically the same stretch routine for my entire student ballet career. So I've just finished ballet class and I think I'm gonna take my hair out of my bun because it's a bit tight for my liking. Um, and I'm gonna put it in a braid because it's sunny out and I think I might be going thrifting with my friends later, which is so fun. Um, I'm also, I am also might go to a workout class. So I'm gonna take the hair oil and just apply that through to the ends to kind of loosen up some of the gel. I love that they have a mini version so I can throw it in my dance bag whenever I have to go somewhere. So I take some of this like so. And there is quite a bit of product already in my hair. I just wanna be sure the curls are really beautifully defined. And there we go. decided to stop and get some content for our socials before heading to L Train to thrift. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> oh, sorry, Poop. I didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> and of course, Dex was absolutely famous. <laughs> we shopped around for a bit and honestly acquired quite a big haul. I can share a separate video of our thrift haul because we did get a lot of things and I didn't want to overpack this video. But I go to yoga! <laughs> yeah. I didn't know, even know she was working today. Afterwards, I just went back to Camilla's place and we watched a movie and had dinner while I worked on some work emails and editing. And yeah, that is the end of today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and comment down below things that you would like to see from me for the future. Thank you for watching.